Hey, what's going on everyone? In today's video, I'm going to be doing a Noob2 Pro series, another one, but this time it's gonna be with a friend. It's gonna be a duo, and we will eventually get some good uh, alt accounts to help our main. So yes, first of all, let's go ahead to the banner and spin some units. We got some gems from the Coast Chainsaw and Nier 2023. Those are free codes and really easy to get gems. You, they give a thousand each and oh my gosh, we got the key, let's go. We only need a key to slow them down and some attack units. Um, I'm pretty sure Tanjiro is actually a really good unit as well. So let me equip him. Okay, we need Underhaul too. He's quite a good unit. So first things first, everyone does it. We gotta go to the story mode. That's right here. My friend Poggerwalk right now. I'm gonna call him Poggerwalk. Pogger walk. Yep. And of course, the first thing we got here, we're gonna have to place down some units and defend. We're gonna place a Todoroki right over here and slow him down. It's gonna be quite easy. Maybe. I hope so. Um so let me just speed up a bit and just wanna tell you today's sponsor. Actually no one sponsored me, I just wanna say that because everyone says that, but um today's sponsor is literally um anime adventures developers for making those two codes out so i can make this video possible and um thank you for the winter event i'll tell you why it's handy soon um yeah but um it's really useful in case you don't know yep so basically what we have to do right now i'm just gonna upgrade my Tanjiro and the other characters and see who does the best damage because I don't even know who um let me have a look maybe Todoroki is the best right now because he can like slow and do attack on both enemies um but Tanjiro is actually really good he does full AoE as well I think they should make a sun breathing Tanjiro soon on the Tanjiro map, but um, he's not out yet, so you know, the arc hasn't been out yet, no one knows the colors, and yeah. But there is no Luffy Gear 5 yet, as well. I'm kind of, I kind of want to see them. The probably the next event is probably the uh, the, 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 the Luffy Gear 5 event where everyone just grinds the heck out of there. Um, let me go ahead to the Act 2. Act 2, come on, let's load in right now. Okay, there we go. Wait, it's already wave 4. Come on, why? It always loads so slow with phones. What's going on with phones? Anyways, uh, place down Todoroki. Let me go ahead and slow the enemies down. <laughs> Easy as that. And there we go. Um, let me go and place Tanjiro over here. We're gonna need his skill that's called Whirlpool. Whirlpool is actually really important for me right now because he can literally do a full AoE on this, the, 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 the enemies. Yeah. Full range. Talking about that. How about that? That's really amazing. Let's ask him if he has a tier 1 ice portal. Oh, he has one. Oh, on the main account. We can't use main accounts. That's the thing. We are doing a noob to pro series. But I'm gonna show you. I'm just gonna tell you this is a uh, tutorial on how to go from noob to pro. Just in case you don't know. And maybe ask it sooner or something like that. But I'll, I'm gonna tell you that following what I do in every single video from right now, from now on, will definitely help you soon. Because my videos are really uh, just basically tutorials on how to play this game, how to play that game. And here's the Noob 2 Pro series for that as well. A lot of you have been asking me in the comment section. If, in case you don't know, some even just spammed my DMs just to make a video with me on Noob 2 Pro series. But I just chose one fan. And that's here, Poco Walk right here, right over here. So I won't be doing much on episode 1, just gonna see how many viewers there are. Just to in order to make another video hopefully you guys subscribe and you watch halfway through congratulations that's the first of all but second of all I just really want you to subscribe because you know it's really good it feels good 
It gives me motivation to do this stuff. Okay, so now let me talk about why it's so good to join the winter events right now. Basically, you know, whenever you join a single game, you get some little EXP for your characters. Yeah, and in winter events, it's actually really hard to win, so you get a lot of experience from this type of game. So the first thing you wanna do, join a game. You wanna maybe place down one unit. Not placing is fine as well, you just lose. But eventually everyone will lose if you're a noob. But that's what I suggest, you should lose to it. There's no downsides to losing to it. There's no downsides, you don't have to worry about it. Just let the game go. Just let the people walk by. You are not winning this. They're, they have like a 12,000 damage or maybe like 2,000 damage and we only do like a thousand to each. Which means every single small unit right over here, they are the bosses for X1. But there are so many enemies right over here that are X1 bosses and we took like 5 seconds to even defeat one boss. Not to mention they have SPA. So basically we're dead. Um, I'm not even gonna lie to you, but maybe going to the winter event area is a good idea. Because, you know, as I've said, your units upgrade, your units level increase magnificently, and you actually will be easier to do future stories while in winter events because you gain a lot of exp that's what i just said but yes it's that important i have to remind you over and over again in case you forget because it's really important and as you can see the levels just keep going up and that's how crazy it is but I'm gonna do a little bit of off-camera grinding later on the winter event. Let's go ahead and join this right now. Okay, we're in. Wave 7. Okay, let's um, place down a unit. Let's place down Tanjiro first. Okay, not, if, not enough money. That's a huge rip. That's okay. It's just not enough money. It's just not enough money. I can deal with that. I think. By the way, Made in Ohio, I mean Made in Heaven is a really amazing character. I'm literally using him right now on my main account. You should probably try it. Let's have a look here. Tanjiro doing most of the work. Okay. Dragon Ball Z. And let's roll ahead. I'm out of context right now. Hopefully, um, this video can help you a lot and help you get from noob to pro just like me. Just follow what I do in this video and you'll be set to go, I think. But yes, um, many of you have also commented on the latest noob to pro series video that I should get a mythical before I finish one video. And I can tell you, it's not even... It's, very hard i don't even have much time to do that but yeah i hope you enjoyed this one and i'll make another one soon hopefully the next time when i play i'll get a mythical and yeah that's basically it for this video hope you enjoyed this new 2 pro series and goodbye